my body has gotten more sensitive to sloop as you guys know me and hunter were two of the first probably you know quote unquote subject matter experts or influencers or whatever the fuck we are to really start pushing this more than a year ago it was like at the end of june early july we started talking about sloop we were taking it from amino asylum i still have 100 micrograms over on my desk and uh, obviously then we started selling it ourselves in capsules when i take meta shred now it's still insanely effective i still think it's a top fat burner on the planet it makes my eyes like not blurry but i i get like rapid blinking and sometimes I get like a I wouldn't call it a fluid but it's just I think from the rapid blinking I'm just kind of getting my eyes are getting kind of wet and I know what it's from you know it's from my mitochondria being overspun it's not I'm not putting myself in danger or anything like that but I would just tell you that if you've used it for a long time you probably want to go off of it you know like if you've used it for four to six months in a row you should probably go off of it for three months that's what I would tell you you know and again when you go off of it you're using now peptides you know mitochondrial optimizing peptides like SS31 Mot C, 5 amino injectable, stuff like that. Even the other stuff, Hunter, that you know, we have now, like OSO1, stuff that's coming. But that's just my thoughts because I never had any issues with it. And I used it hardcore for at least six or seven months.